Oh, look what came in today. I'm OG, y'all new to the game. Decided to get some spark plugs because I had trouble starting. So, oh fuck, there it goes. <laughs> Pick me up some Densos. Got the uh, ITV 22s. And yeah. So just took out one. And look at this shit, guys. Alright, guys, installed the new spark plugs. Let's go see what gonna happen. Survey says. Oh fuck yeah. Oh fuck yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Hell yeah. You guys are gonna see how low this fucking car is gonna go. Alright, peace out. Alright guys, it's pretty late out. Well, it's not really late. It's probably like 9 o'clock at night. But I got real dirty. It took forever. And we are rushed at the auto hobby shop. But yeah, take a look at my car. Oh wait, you guys can't really look. It's kind of dark. So let me just, boom, just like that. Turn night into day. Wow. Let's see. I can put my finger on through here, but when it comes to the back, there's no budget. I mean, this shit is fucking low, and I'm rubbing everywhere. But it looks sick, though. Look what came in the mail today. Got my G Plus elbow intake. This will definitely replace that little snorkel plastic shit that comes with the uh, OEM intake box. Let's see if I can open this with one hand. Alright. So what you get here is this nice silicone elbow hose. Never go wrong with more clamps, alright? Got these. And more stickers. Word.
much that looks so cool. I'm, I just don't like rubbing. And I, it's just like an inkling in my mind saying that's not right and all that. So yes, I'm on my way to the Audi shop right now. The Audi shop. The auto shop right now. Um, I'm gonna get those fixed by adjusting the coilovers at the rear end. And I'm thinking since my rear is so lower than the front, if I just raise the rear a little bit, it'll kind of even out with what's up in the front, and hopefully I can get a nice ride height that I don't have to see. It's fucking rubbing right there. A nice ride height so that I don't have to adjust the front at all, but most likely I do. While I'm there, I might as well install this elbow right here, so it all works out. After that, I'm probably gonna head back home and uh, start packing. Gives me and Scotty and a couple of homies. We're gonna go snowboarding. Probably get some little video footage of that, and it's probably gonna be on a separate video. bit of a uh, bad news over here so we were on our way to the res ski resort but we ended up having to stop at our homies apartment complex because something happened I don't know if you guys can see you guys can't probably see but uh yeah you guys can't probably fucking see that so what happens is well, let me tell you a story. If you're ever driving in Virginia, you see people swerving a lot. It's either they're drunk or they're avoiding potholes. Well, in my case, the highways are so shitty that I um, went over like a little pothole and the strut came off my race lands. I don't know if it's the actual strut of the race lands. Hopefully it's not, but the whole mount from Mazda, the, the OEM mount, ripped off so I had to order a new one probably have to fix that around Monday but I'm still enjoying my time here snowboarding just giving you guys status update all right what's up guys so we got our rental gear out we're on our way to wintergreen yeah. goggles, up. goggles up bros Got all our shit right here. It's gonna be awesome, dude. Catch this out.
So, got back in Virginia Beach, picked up this beautiful camera for a good ass deal on our way back home. And uh, snowboarding was fun. Didn't capture any video footage because my dumb ass forgot the GoPro at the car I was using to get up there. I'm gonna pick up this tripod for this new camera. It's gonna be sick, dude. Stunner shades. <laughs> Forgot mine in my car. <laughs> yeah, this camera's pretty dope. Holy shit, so fucking clear. Let's see if I can do it right for it. Oh. <laughs> you recording right now? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, what, what do you guys think about the video quality, guys? It's gonna be so dope. Now we can get awesome shots with our cars. Dude. So yeah, we're picking up this tripod for only five bucks. We're just gonna drop there and then just hand the money. <laughs> this is so nice, man. Flip down camera or screen. It's fucking cool. Dude, that's so fucking clear, man. <laughs> the day in the life. <laughs> See easy. See easy. New nickname. Ooh. Ooh, what do you guys know about that forge blow off valve, guys? <laughs> God damn. Unleashing the beast. The beast of Medusa right here. You guys didn't know. <laughs> What's going on, guys? Another beautiful day here at Virginia Beach, looking at 70 degree weather using this awesome DSLR camera. You can probably see all the food on my face from Wendy's. <laughs> JK. So what we're doing today, right now, is we got these PVC pipes. We're gonna make a little cheap stabilizer. All you guys really need is, where the fuck did I put? This right here. One long PVC pipe and some attachments. We got some T, we got like three T's, a cap, and a couple elbows. Essentially, we're gonna make like a three handled stabilizer. So, it's gonna sit in one of these. We're gonna probably gonna pop a screw up here, screw on the camera, and then use the fittings as accordingly to make our little little stabilizer it's gonna be pretty dope pretty cheap it's only like what 10 bucks to make yeah, 1087. 1087 to make we got it from Lowe's and as you know I bought my bolts as well bought my uh, <clears throat> bolts for my strut uh, fucking strut holder coming in tomorrow so hopefully we can get that out of the way. We're just gonna set up everything now, so everything's gonna be an easy process by tomorrow. Word. I'm gonna grab your cap. You can uh, hold it with some pliers like that. I'm gonna get our little drill over here, table drill. Place it in the center like so, so you can, when you put it down and start drilling, it's dead in the center. guys after you have done that what you want to do is grab one of the screws uh, in our case for our, oops, for our DSLR camera we're using the 1420 by one see if that focuses and you can get this at Lowe's you put your little bolt like so inside the cap fitting 
and you want to take a little nut, locking nut right there, tie it out with a ratchet. It was an 11 millimeter for us, and you want to put in another little nut right there on top of it so you can adjust how long you need the threads to be. Bruh. Alright guys, so that piece we just made is a little selfie stick and it's on the camera right now. And it's working pretty good. Holy shit. That is awesome. Now I can walk around. Look how, oh that's stable dude. We're at running out of battery. guys put my grape drake down this is our stabilizer fully equipped with PVC pipes hold it like so you can hold it like this you got that little curves up for those low angle shots it's just all Gucci guys next steps is probably paint it black or I don't know sticker bomb it what do you guys think Leave a comment on below. We'll, we'll leave it blank until we get a comment. <laughs> <laughs> what color?